Hi, my name is Mark Thieu and I'm from the Facade Engineering and Technology Department in BCA. So my work mainly involves the periodic facade inspection regime, shaping a technology-enabled facade inspection ecosystem and attending to fallen facade incidents. Tell us more about the importance of facade inspection and maintenance. So facade of a building is basically the exterior faces of a building and sometimes these exterior faces can dislodge and fall if they are not properly maintained thereby endangering members of the public. When we talk about facade maintenance, usually people will think of painting and cleaning. But then we need to actually have periodic inspection as well. So a good facade maintenance program will help us discover potential facade failures, thereby allowing interventions to be carried out before disaster strikes. Two of the recent incidents involving a 21 kg stone panel and a 1 meter casement window, which fell on high human traffic walkways are especially vivid. So the victims suffered cuts by the ricocheting projectiles, but then the situation would have been very different if someone was directly hit by these fallen facade elements. How does BCA investigate facade failures? A good understanding of the fixing mechanism and its condition is critical. So depending on the situation, we may deploy tools such as mirrors, bore scope, and metal detectors. Sometimes investigation works may also require us to take statements from the project parties, um, do material testing in accredited laboratories, and also perform design checks. Based on our past investigation, we found that most of the incidents could have been avoided if proper maintenance were being carried out. What do BCA engineers do on site? So when we are alerted to an incident, we have three priorities. Number one, ensure public safety. Number two, investigate the cause of incident and number three, eliminate any residual risk. So when we arrive on site, we will ensure that the affected areas are off limits to the public. And then we will instruct the building owners to engage professional engineers to kickstart the investigation and the rectification works. How does BCA typically manage an incident like this? We have incident teams on standby 24-7 to respond to an incident within two hours of being notified. Term contractors are also on standby in the event of a major incident requiring immediate intervention. What is the role of BCA in preventing potential facade or window failures? We believe strongly in raising the awareness of good maintenance, so we share with the industry lessons learned from past incidents and also continuously update them on the good maintenance procedures and the telltale signs of facade failures. We also carry out the 6-6 and 12-12 window maintenance publicity to educate the public on the three C's of window maintenance. Check, clean and change. Any thoughts or what you learned from both incidents? I think that wear and tear on buildings comes with age and a structured and periodic facade maintenance program will help to prevent incidents from endangering members of the public. To help building owners achieve that, the PFI regime requires buildings that are over a certain height and age to be inspected every seven years. We are also revolutionizing the way facade inspections are being carried out by introducing technology such as drones, AI and machine learning to help facade inspectors achieve a more comprehensive facade inspection. Let's all play our part in keeping Singapore's built environment safe. Bye!